Hello everyone, uh, this is Nellie Deutsch and I'd like to welcome you to WebQuest for Active Lifelong Learners, W for All. I'd like to first of all introduce you to um, our virtual learning environment, which is a Moodle. I'm not sure whether all of you are familiar with the Moodle, but you will certainly get to know it as we um, go along. Okay, so just um, a little bit of an introduction here. The Moodle has three major parts. Okay, it's got the central part, the left, and the right. Now let me just open the blocks here. As you can see, there are various blocks that can be added to the right or to the left. Okay, these can be um, moved around. Okay, you can get a block menu, blog tags, uh, a calendar, a course site description, okay, which um, we have on top, so there's no need to add it. HTML, if I want to add anything. And by the way, if you'd like me to add things, uh, please feel free to let me know, and I'll be able to do that. A loan calculator, we don't really need that. Messages, mobile access, which is possible. Online users to see who's online. Okay, that's always nice. Okay, and first of all, I'll log in. Turn on the editing. then I can add some blocks. Okay, so I'll open that up and I want to add online users and see who's online. Okay, right now it's only me. Okay, but it's nice if you see each other, you get a chance to perhaps click on the um, image of the person's name. Okay, get uh, profile. Okay, let's go back. Um, and then let's see if there's anything else that we can add here. There are of course tags that are always relevant. Um, and I think that's uh, remote feeds that we might want to get from other places. And uh, site description. Okay, maybe we'll get a calendar in, in here. Here's IQ live class. Okay, if you want to set that up, okay, as part of um, the Moodle. Okay, here there's a session that's going to take place tomorrow. And I think that uh, mobile access may be interesting for some who would like to access the class through their cell phones. Again, as I said, these things can be moved up and down. I think I'll add an R HTML. I'd love to add it, but I'll add that later. Course description. I can also add that. Okay, so whatever I think is important, I'll add on top. Latest news, I think, upcoming events. We, we might want to do the calendar, so move down. I think this I'll move down. I can also move things right, as I said, right and left. Okay, by, um, here I'll show you what it looks like. Uh, things are moved. As you can see, there's an arrow pointing move left, an arrow pointing move up, and of course one going down. And the administration you won't see. I'll show you what you will see. Okay, I'll switch roles to uh, a web quester, okay, this is what you would see. You would see yourself on top with your image. Okay, and then you would see um, those who are online. You would also uh, be advised to go to forums because that's what you'll be engaged in. So far, I think many of you have um, done the introductions. Okay, so I can go into that. 
names so far. I see five people have. Okay, there's Jade. It can always add a new discussion instead of going into mine. And it can also relate to the others. You can create your own as Jane and um, Anur Daha did. So if you go into this one, you'll probably see a few people who introduce themselves. Okay. And you might want to. <laughs> there's Melba. Um, Jennifer Carmella. Okay, so you might want to um, respond to them as well. So just realize that even though it says Nellie Deutsch over here, others have gone in and introduced themselves there too. But again, if you want to get uh, attention to your uh, topic, okay, you would add a new discussion topic. Okay, let's go back to the class and show you how it's going to work. Okay, uh, the sessions are divided into weeks right now. We only see uh, the pre. We don't see uh, the week. Let me just go back to my normal rule so you can get a peek at what's going to happen. Okay, here is the second uh, part. Okay, if you like. Okay, it's divided into, I can always change that. There's the uh, the first the first week web plus module, um, and uh, the reason you don't see anything right now is because it hasn't been added yet. It's um, hidden. Okay, everything can be hidden, and the only way I can unhide it is by turning on. Okay, this is what I do, and then all I have to do is turn the eye, and then you'll get a chance to look at it. But sometimes it's distracting for students to see too much. They don't know where to start. So uh, we keep things off. Okay, as you can see, the eye, it's hidden because uh, it's not shown to the students right now. Okay, because I'd like you to first of all introduce yourself and then take this needs assessment survey. I see that one person has done it. All you have to do is, uh, if you have a question, of course, you add a new uh, topic to ask a question, but you just go into needs assessment. Okay, and just fill it in. There are a few questions here that uh, would be interesting for everyone, I think, to see um, where we start off. People's backgrounds. Once you do it, you'll be able to um, see the score. Okay, so. What you have to do in order to navigate and manage the uh, workshop, if you're not familiar with the Moodle, is just to follow, as you can see, the introductions here. Okay, let me show you the way you would see it again, not to confuse you. Let's turn on the uh, icons here. Okay, so just go into the introduction, introduce yourself, and then uh, conduct the needs assessment survey. And that's it. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me. So enjoy the course. We're officially going to start on July 6th. So uh, keep asking questions. Thank you. Bye for now.